today we are going to go over horoscopes for July for Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Um, so yeah, let's just hop right in. So what can Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising expect whoops, for the month of July? What can Aries expect for the month of July? <clears throat> Okay, Aries, so this actually looks like things are going to be shaping up really well for you for the month of July. Um, seems like some of you have this, like, heavy burden that you're really feeling the need to, to let go of. Um, so some of you are really going to be able to do that. You're realizing that this thing is kind of throwing you off balance with other things in your life. So you're working on trying to create more balance in your life. And in doing this, you're going to get to a point where, like, you're finally able to take care of yourself, like, by yourself. You're not relying on anybody else. So I think that's super awesome. Um, and along with this, too, for some of you, anyway, it's showing you may have been struggling recently with, like, thoughts, like, um, overwhelming thoughts or, like, your mind's just going and going and going and you don't know how to shut it off. And, like, all of that's making you feel like crazy almost. So that's going to ease up, too, um, in the month of July. It looks like you're getting yourself into a position where you're going to be doing, like, a lot of healing with your anxiety and everything like that. Um, really great. So I would definitely suggest, Aries, maybe starting some type of exercise practice. Um, if you're not doing that already, that would be, like, almost like your meditation. Like, Aries energy is probably going to have a tough time, like, really being able to sit still and quiet the mind, Um so exercise is actually a great alternative for Aries. Um, so there's also something coming up for you where it's showing like your intuition is going to be greatly, greatly heightened um, in the month of July. So that's super exciting. So, but all this is leading to in, in July is victory and success. So this is super, super exciting for you, Aries. Yay. Okay. So let's see what Aries can focus on healing this month. So we'll get you a soul truth card, Aries, and then I'll pick you a healing card. So let's see. What can Aries, what is Aries' uh, soul truth card for the month of July? And then we'll see. What can Aries heal? For the month of July. Okay. So a couple things here. This is actually one of the cards that came out, sexual art. So really work on loving other people, but also loving yourself, becoming a loving mirror. Um, so this is all about self-love and the love of other people. So definitely work on that this month. And for your soul truth card, oh my gosh, how funny. How does my body want to move today? So we were just talking about that for you guys, Aries. Um, so when we move, we change our state and we raise our vibration. This new elevated state becomes a channel for more energy. Are you moving your body daily? Are you passionate about it? Is it time to try something new? So today's soul So the month's soul action for you, Aries is how does your body want to move today? Listen and joyfully do. So that's really awesome. I think this is a great reading for you, Aries. Work on getting rid of that stuff that's not serving you, on creating more balance and self-love and love for other people in your life. By the end of the month, you'll be in a position where you are standing on your own two feet and you're going to feel super confident. I'm super excited for you, Aries, and I will see you next month. Let me know in the comments if this resonates with you. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share to help me build my channel. Um, and feel free, too, in the comments to post anything about yourself, anything you want to hear, um, any readings you want me to do, whatever, you, whatever suggestions you have. That would be wonderful. Um, thank you so much, guys, and I'll see you next month.